This YouTube is about getting DMR contacts for free. It seems wherever you look, somebody wants some money for something. This is the free way. I'm going to be exploring first how to download the contacts database, then how to trim it down for a particular radio, and uploading into the radio. Let's crack on. Okay, we first pull up a browser such as Chrome, and on the address line, we're going to type radioid.net. Here is radioid.net. So this is the new look um, as of, I want to say, the end of 2020, early 2021. What we're interested in is finding the uh, data in the database. So if we go over to the left here and we select database, go away from where your eye is catching and look for this uh, text link here database dump files and from here we're looking for user.csv if we click there it should download in the case of Chrome it appears down here I'm just going to quickly copy that out and I'm going to rename it user contacts from the radio ID and I'm going to date code it today which is the 14th of January so uh, 21 for the year 01 14 and there we have it so let's take a look inside inside that file and see how many contacts we have so by going to the first column pressing end and the down arrow on your keyboard we find 183,688 contacts so that's within um, the Anytone uh, radio and the Alinko radio's capabilities, um, but outside of the Retivis RT52. So let's, uh, let's go check here. So how much will my radio take? So the Anytone 878 200,000, Retivis RT52 100,000, the Linko DJMD5 200 and the uh, TYTMD380 is 120 which is a, a great improvement on the original 4000 that they, they had on the original models okay so at 183,000 um, the Anytone and the Alinko uh, the size of the database doesn't need cutting down however if you're going to be putting this into the Retivis or the uh, TYT you will need to use uh, something else to, to reduce the amount of contact lines down to within the capabilities of the radio. You can either do this directly in Excel or you can do this in an access database. Uh, both ways has its advantages and I shall show you on a separate video. So what's next? We're going to adapt the contact database name fields to match the name fields of the radios so that we can import them and also a demonstration of reducing the amount of lines in a contact list to suit smaller radios for this you obviously need to know your radio's capacity so search out my channels for the matching videos now for the Anytone 878 the Retivis RT52 and the Alinko DJ MD5. Enjoy! So this video, if you like it or video, comment down below or thumbs up. Thanks for watching VA3SII. Bye!